Very busy there in Warung de Mar also. Quite a few customers. Hello. Oh my god, oh la la. That is absolutely packed inside there. So so busy. Jumbo prong, lobster, and so on. Lots of seafood, yeah? the Western foods. Good evening from Bali, Indonesia. So this evening I'm here in the Kutar area of Bali. I'm on a street called Jalankartika Plaza. And what I'm gonna feature in this evening's video for you is a street walking tour along the street of Jalankartika Plaza. Now Jalankartika Plaza Street, for those of you that are not familiar with it, it's a very popular tourist area here in the um, central Kuta area. Um, it's got um, two malls located on this street, Discovery Shopping Mall, also Lippo Shopping Mall. You've got an absolutely fabulous collection of restaurants, shopping options, all available on this street here. So what I'm going to do in this evening's video is I'm going to um, use the Discovery Shopping Mall as a starting point and I'm going to walk all the way through to where the um, where we meet the Kuta Art Market and also an area called Kuta Square and just show you everything along the way. So without any further ado, let's go and get started and take a stroll along Jalankartika Plaza. Okay, so here's a start point for this evening's video. We're right outside Discovery Shopping Mall here in Kuta and there's some entertainment going on in the top. I'll just give you a brief look at that when they start the music again. And then this is the street um, just opposite Discovery Mall. We have Warung Telegas across the street there, Beres Mera also across the street there, two restaurants, Spice Mantra. We'll take you across um, those in a minute. We'll just take you up here to Discovery Shopping Mall first of all. There's the main entrance to Discovery Shopping Mall in the back there. Have a Burger King here. Five Monkeys Fresh Burgers there. Stairs. Okay, so back down at the bottom now of Discovery Mall. Right across the street, we have a place called Spice Mantra, inspirational Indian cuisine. It's continuing up the street now. So just at um, Discovery Shopping Mall, we also have Sogo, which is a department store. And then just across the street there, this place is called Bamboo Bar and Grill. Just cut across the street to the Bamboo Bar and Grill. It's going to be quite busy inside there. It's okay, yeah? It's quite busy inside the, the Bamboo Bar and Grill. Many customers in there. Just continuing walking up the street, we have the Water Bomb Barley here, which is obviously now closed. We're just going to cut back across this side of the street now. have a place called Warung de Mar. It's a 
name on here. It's very busy there in Wurrung Damar also. Quite a few customers. Hello! Just continue walking up the street now. So just on the opposite side of the street there you have a collection of ATM machines. There's also a money changer. Just here we have Club Havana. Just in the back there. Hello! Just next door to Club Havana we have Bali Garden Beach Resort. I've covered this place in a video. Fabulous accommodation option. Have some horse and carts also over the street there. Let's continue walking. So there's the name, the Bali Garden Beach Resort. It's just in the back there. Okay, so just from the Bali Garden Beach Resort there in the back, it's a fabulous hotel that. We're just going to continue walking up the street. Just across the street there, we have a place called Bubba Gump Shrimp Co. We'll take you across and show you Bubba Gump Shrimp. After working between all of these taxis, and cars and transport, there's the name up above. Some of the drinks available. There's the inside of Bubba Gump Shrimp and Co. Hello, good evening. Just continuing up the street now, just across the street. I think this is connected with the um, Bali Garden Beach Resort. We have the beer garden. Quite a few customers inside there, inside the uh, beer garden. Also a pool table there to the side. It's a pasta night also. Just continue walking up. Have the um, big flat screen TVs playing the um, Aussie Rules football up above there. We have um, coffee and queue here, which is coffee and cake. It's a coffee shop. Just one customer in the side here, just in the back. Next we have a place called Temple by Ginger Moon. Have all the horse and carts across the street there. Just back here, this is a place called Temple by Ginger Me Moon. Sorry about the bright lights. It's quite busy there inside Temple by Ginger Moon. Quite a few customers in there. name up above very busy street as you can see all the traffic a little bit of a darkness on the street now overhanging trees ducking the head now we're going to cut across the road, uh, road to a place called Dolce Vita Italian Restaurant and Pizzeria. Oh my god, oh la la. That is absolutely packed inside there. So, so busy. It's absolutely full outside, full inside. So many customers. Just across the road, we're going to move back across the road. We have the uh, Wake Bali Art Market getting beeped at by the taxis for walking in front. Oh no, he's beeping for customers, sorry. It's a big um, tourist art market inside here. Many tourist goods there. Just back on the other side of the street, we have Kimberley Spa. That's in the green there. We have one kitchen next door to Kimberley Spa. So we're just going to cut across the street now. So there's Kimberley Spa there in the back. 
all the massage girls outside oh, we can't show you what's available it's too bright just next door we have a place called Wong Kitchen Wong Kitchen's just in the back there some customers sat inside Wong Kitchen there there's the happy hours at Wong Kitchen Beautiful foods also. Barbecue ribs. Let's continue walking. Just next door, I think this is a, um, I'll just show you the name actually and then we'll come back to the guy, Gong XI Fai Chai. It's a very popular um, seafood restaurant this, you can see the guy cooking all the um, seafood here, ooh la la, wow. Jumbo prawn, lobster and so on. Lots of seafood, yeah? Yeah. And as you can see it's very very busy inside there, full house, all the tables full. Great place for seafood, this. Just give you an idea of some of the price here. It's the Western foods. Very, very busy inside. Just across the street we have a mini mart. We also have Hotel Karsha just over there. We have a um, Alpha Mart here. Which also has a bean spot which is a coffee shop inside the Alpha Mart. We have the Restro Melaste over the street there which is connected with the um, Melaste Hotel. I'll just take you across the street and show you the Malaste Hotel. There's the Malaste beach, uh, beach bungalows and spa in the back there. Just in case you can't see the name, we've got it here. And then just um, continuing on up the street, I'm going to walk and then turn back. So you have some tourist goods shops just in the um, side there, selling all your typical tourist goods, handbags, trainers, things. Have a tourist information, tour booking um, booth here on the corner. And then just turning around and back on the opposite side of the road. This blue building here is a place called Jan's House. So Jan's House, I've already featured that accommodation in a video. We just continue walking up the street now. Hello, good evening, how are you? Oh, thank you. Say hello, say something. Hello. <laughs> so we just have a um, ladies clothing shop here, DJ Butterfly. 100k, three pieces, some ladies shorts there. Also have some ladies um, tops here for the beach and things. Nice collection on there. And then we'll continue walking up the street. Next on the left here, this is Matilda's Sports Bar. They've just actually extended Matilda's Sports Bar to the left here. It's very, very big now, Matilda's Sports Bar. Is it the same, Matilda still, yeah? Okay, can I just show this bit, yeah? So just inside, this is, this is the new section here at Matilda, beautiful seating area, big screen TV in the back there. Also have some seating here overlooking the roadside. And then there's the original Matilda in the back there. There's a few customers in there. We have another big flat screen TV on the back wall also. Some table football here. And I will continue, thank you so much. And then we'll just continue walking up the street. So that's the name, Matilda Sports Bar. 
So you have all these nice um, seating areas on the uh, footpath as well. Just show you some of the things here at Matilda Sports Bar. Just continue walking up the street now so the next place on the left hand side here is going to be a place called um, Paradiso Hotel there's the name there Kuta Paradiso Hotel Just across the road there we have um, Seafood House, as in the name, it's a seafood restaurant, there's a few customers in the, um, in the front there I see, big crab um, coming down at the main entrance there, and then this um, is a place called Bee Couple, so Bee Couple's going to be quite popular, there's quite a few customers here at Bee Couple. Just spinning around, we have a um, horse and cart there. Just back onto B Couple now, so you can see there's quite a few customers there inside B Couple. I'll just show you the name up above there. There's a name, B Couple. Have some nice um, seating as well along here. There's another horse and cart going up the street again. Just across the street from B Couple we have Bluefin. This is a Japanese fusion restaurant. There's a seafood house next door to Bluefin. We have a new um, Pepito Express. This is a convenience store here. Just continue walking up the street. You see there's quite a few tourists in this area at this time of night. Just across the street there we have a new Italian restaurant called El Dente. There's the name up above El Dente. There's a few customers inside El Dente. nice new Italian restaurant that we're going to cut back across the street so I can show you a full view on the next place next door to El Dente and show you this place also this is a place called Warung Kuta handicrafts gifts and souvenir many many things in the back there it's a huge tourist goods shop this lots of souvenirs So some outside the front here and some tour booking agents and things as well there. And then just across the street there we have um, Stadium Calf Sports Bar. It's a very popular um, sports bar this. Unfortunately we're not. <laughs> not allowed inside there, it's quite busy inside with customers. Just continuing walking up the street next to Stadium Sports Bar, we have Flapjacks Barley. We'll just make our way across the street just to show you Flapjacks Barley close up, almost getting hit by the traffic. So there's the name up above, this is Flapjacks Barley. It's just attached to the um, Stadium Sports Bar. Hi. And then now we're coming. <laughs> Now we're coming to the end of the um, uh, video here, just across the street here now we've um, arrived at the Cooter Art Market. We have one more place across the street there, this is connected to the Ramayana Hotel. I'll just cut back across for the sake of it just to show you, it's quite busy inside, I'm not quite sure of the name. 
quite a few customers inside there though. There's a name up above. Stop cooking on here again. So some live music in there. And then now we're going to cut across the street to the Cooter Art Market. So this is the Passai Sene um, Cooter, otherwise known as the Cooter Art Market. That's located just down in the back there. You can also access Cooter Beach from this point. And then I'm just going to take you up to this one last point here now um, and just show you. Hello, good evening, sir. How are you? Good, good, good. <laughs> and then just continuing on um, here now, this is a place called Cooter Square. So this is like the central Cooter area. This is going to be home to, there's not really many restaurants in this area. Um, there's a few, but it's mostly um, shopping. Um, there's lots of handbags, clothes and things all in this area here. Yes. So this is Cooter Square. Okay, so that concludes this evening's um, night walk here at Jalan Kartika Plaza here in the Kuta area. So as you've seen with the camera in this evening's video, you've got a fabulous collection of um, restaurants, um, shopping options, starting from Discovery Shopping Mall, you've got some um, shops and some souvenir shopping also in this area. This is just a really fabulous area of Kuta to stay for your holiday here in Bali. So on that note, hope you've enjoyed this evening's video. Hope many of you find this video useful useful and it's helpful in some way or another and I shall say bye for now